rank. All of Prolepolis International needs our help, Daisuke. We'll deal with this base later. Oh no. The Vega have littered the runways with their debris. Get that rubble out of there as soon as possible. We'll need these runways to evacuate the airport. Well done, Daisuke. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Soldier Boomerang!
look at those rocks. that? A Vegatron catalyst? Use Grandizer's photon sensors to absorb its rays, Daisuke. Anti-gravity storm! Shoulder boomerang! Airlines flight 44,000. The runway is clear again. You can take off. All in all, we're not doing so bad. Um, Daisuke, my radio is going crazy. Listen to this. How could such primitive aircraft escape you? Make an example of this place, or I'll make an example of you. If the enemy's starting to panic, it means that we're making progress, my dear Koji. Let's keep up the good work. Water is Earth's most precious resource. I must protect it. Shoulder boomerang! That forge is running on fumes, Daisuke. We have to deal with it as soon as possible. Get rid of the central generator sun. The machine should collapse in on itself. Yeah. Shoulder boomerang! Get rid of the central generator sunk. The machine should collapse in on itself.
Forge is gone, the armies of Vega are sure to dwindle. This can only be good news for Earth. Koji almost died up there. We should discuss a new vehicle together. A vehicle worthy of his talents. Until then, let's... Mitchell to all units. I have a big bunch of VIPs to evacuate and hurry. We're holed up with the firefighters. Where the heck are you? Seems like this guy could use a little help. Let's find him. Isn't this that famous robot with all its lights and steel? The one they call Grandizer? The one and only. How can I help you? I've got to deliver these big shots to a military base nearby. And there aren't exactly many ways to get there. We've got to put the pedal to the metal, so follow me, dude. Oh no, here they come. I can kiss my career goodbye. Don't talk nonsense. We'll make it. Geyser Punch!
Here comes some more! in the clear. See you on the other side. Careful. It feels like a trap. Come on, Grindizer. We're almost there. But the bigwigs still have to get on their little choppers. And unlucky for us, this place is perfect for an ambush. If I were a little green man with pointy ears, this is exactly where I'd spring the trap. Capiche? I hear you. But you've got nothing to worry about. I've got your back. You're one heck of a dude. I knew we could count on you. Let's go, boys. My radio's jammed with Vega screeching. It must be Blackie. What does he want with us this time? Strike hard! Take out the Earth's leaders! Execute! Get ready, Daisuke. Things are hotting up. Watch out, kid. They're asking for it. <laughs> Think about it. Promise. We've got a problem, boys. A colleague's observatory is not responding. I'm sending you its location. Please head there now. You can count on us, Professor. We'll see what's going on over there. discriminating but why do you think they would attack an observatory just like father's laboratory its instruments could have picked up something important something like what a saucer beast it's quite possible let's be careful Dizer punch anti-gravity storm Dizer punch Anti-gravity storm! Shoulder boomerang! Shoulder boomerang! Anti-gravity storm! 
According to my scopes, the power to the observatory has been cut off. In that case, you'll have to turn it back on by making your way to a power station. Follow the pylons, and you'll soon find one. Something's going on. These Vega will do anything to get in our way. Dizer punch! Time we're sure. Vega has something to hide. Punch! Guys, they're punch! It's the plant. Let's get rid of these creeps so we can restore the power. Gravity store! to restart that power plant. The power seems to be back, Father. Good. Let's see what the observatory has to say. Professor, we were cut off. Professor Uman, are you there? Can you hear me? Loud and clear, my dear fellow. What's the matter? I have some very important information to give you. According to our telescopes, the Vega saucers are gathering in great numbers at point 16B. I fear a second attack is in the offing. Have no fear. I'm passing this information on to Grandizer. We'll take it from there. Thank you. The mass gathering of saucers? Could there be a saucer beast among them? We'll know for sure soon.
You see what I see, Daisuke? Those sources didn't come on their own. Let's teach them some manners. Soldier boomerang! Look at those things, Daisuke. Say what you like about the Vega, but their machines are remarkable. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Daisuke? Mm. I'm not sure where you're going with this. Come on! If, as the Observatory says, a new invasion force is approaching, this is the perfect opportunity to surprise them. You'd really board one of their saucers? Koji, you could get killed. We don't have time for this nonsense. Think about it. I'd have access to all their communications from here. If any other sources or saucer beasts approach, we'll stop them dead in their tracks before they even get started. Although it's risky, this plan is our best chance of defending the region from another attack. We must trust Koji, my son. Agreed. I'll sweep the ground. You monitor the air, Koji. Count me in, Daisuke. Let's see if these sources handle themselves as well as the TFO. All aircraft, regroup immediately with your mothership. Hurry up! It's Blackie. The Vega are up to no good. I've got to fly more casually. I don't want anyone to spot me. So far, they're not paying any attention to me. But let's not take any chances. Our whole formation. Just long enough to get closer. There's their mothership. Let's see what it's got inside, literally. Perfect. Now, let's ditch the disguise. Fire the cannons! This is for Daisuke! And this is for ruining my demonstration! Ha! Not so smart now, are you? These sources are pretty decent. I'll make a full report to the professor. It might come in handy. Our mothership has been damaged by one of our devices. I won't tolerate any dissension in our ranks. Find that renegade and eliminate him. Come on, man. Think like a Vega. Fly like a Vega. against me. You think they really care about their sources? Get ugly. I must warn Daisuke. 
But first, it's time to bash some saucers. How about that? They're round, ugly, and they're back. You want some more? All right, take that. Let's see which of us is the best pilot. I thought you were tougher than that. Like they're retreating. Let's take the opportunity to contact Grendizer. Daisuke, Blackie has just sent orders to deploy a saucer beast to the old radio telescope's location. Go, I'll take care of the remaining saucers. Stay on the alert, Daisuke. You're approaching the radio telescope. Strange. The place looks abandoned to me. There's not the slightest trace of a saucer beast. Perhaps someone in this house saw it lurking. I've spent my life watching the stars, and now they send me one of their warriors to strike me down. How ironic. Don't be afraid, Grandpa. I'm on your side. You don't say. I didn't know we had machines like that in our army. Actually, I'm not really from here. Really? Then where are you from, young man? From... another planet. From another planet? How I envy you. I would have liked to visit another planet. But I've only seen the stars through my telescope. Unfortunately, I had no choice. I was forced to leave. What a sad story. I imagine you miss your planet terribly. Where we come from, we all only have one, after all. Your words really strike a chord. I don't know how to thank you. Oh, but I do! Could you take a look at my old satellite dish? There was a time when it spoke to the stars. I don't want that monster to disturb its rest. A monster? Count me in, Grandpa. to attack an abandoned building. Their thirst for destruction knows no bounds. Watch out, son. If this saucer beast is waiting for you, it may be smarter than the other. Dies their punch! Shoulder boomerang! Where are you hiding? 
cursing machine. Ah, there you are. I thought so. That saucer beast wanted to trap you in his huge dish. Don't worry. This monster's going to answer to me. Watch out for those chains. Let's keep our distance. Shoulder boomerang! Time has come, saucer beast. Yeah! Shoulder boomerang. Double. Park it! <laughs> that creature is history. Now, can we get through to Koji, father? I'm here, buddy. And I hope that that saucer beast is down. Because I'm sick of flying saucers. See you at the laboratory. Dizer jump! Spazer go! Spazer cross! Shoot out! Meanwhile, on the dark side of the moon, Blackie is brooding. I must eliminate Prince Duke, who is thwarting our plans to conquer the Earth, or I'll be stripped of my command forever. I won't stand for such an insult. Blackie, our scanners have reported an unknown aircraft in our shipping lane. Some of our forces have already been destroyed by this craft. I take it you both recognize the symbol on its hull? Yes. That is the insignia of the Royal Guard, the Destructor Commandos. The soldiers from this division are the most dangerous I know. They fear nothing. 
Not even wolves. We'd better be ready for them then. It's good to see you again, Blackie. General Kantal. Greetings, Captain Gorman. Have you come a long way to see us? From the Vega Nebula, on King Vega's orders. What is all this? Don't you dare claim that your mission had anything to do with opening fire on us? Did you have to shoot down our fighter units? Did you have to disable several shuttles? No, I'm here to assess the potential of your forces, and as I suspected, they're paltry. I've concluded that it's impossible to defeat Vendizer with such limited means. I don't see how that's any of your business, Gorman. You should watch what you say to me. You seem to have forgotten that I was sent by King Vega and that I'm acting under his orders. But you don't need to worry about any of that anymore. Now it's my turn to take your place. I'm the new commander of the attack forces. I don't take orders from you, Gorman. The Royal Guard is under the direct orders of King Vega. We must obey Gorman and hand over the command to him. Our master trusts him. You have only to obey, Blackie. Very good. I will obey. Put our Sasa beasts on high alert. We'll attack tomorrow. And don't disturb me. I'm going to sleep. We should do the same. Sleep on it, Blackie. I leave you to your rest. My premonition is confirmed. If Gorman succeeds in defeating Prince Duke and destroying Drendizer, King Vega will remove me from office for good. I don't deserve such humiliation. A few days later, at the Makiba family ranch. What if my dream was a premonition? What if some terrible fiend has come to Earth exclusively to take me down? But all I want is peace and for love to triumph. Daisuke! Daisuke! I think something is happening in the sky! In the sky? Why? What did you see up there? Nothing. At school I learned all about migratory birds, but here I don't see any. Isn't that strange? You're right. At this time of year, they should be flying over our land in droves. Maybe the UFOs scare them as much as we do. Hikaru told me the same thing. Since then, she's been watching for the slightest cloud. Maybe you should talk to her. I think she's scared. It's normal to be scared, you know. But I'll talk to her. Don't you worry. Still on the prowl, Daisuke? Get back to work before old Danbei sees you. He's not in a good mood lately. I saw him take some kind of machine gun out of his barn. Bam, 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 bam. Hikaru didn't tell you about me? I hope she wasn't too scared in the belly of that monster. It's time for the Friends of the Aliens Association to evolve! The Vega will pay. I come from a powerful line of samurai. You can't fool me! You look worried, Hikaru. Is everything okay? I think so, Daisuke. But what happened in Tokyo is still on my mind. Don't worry about it. I'm sure that brighter memories will soon replace that horrible day in your mind. I envy your carefree attitude. Lately, I've been worrying about one thing after another. 
the ranch and all the work here. Goro and his duties, Dad and his cylindrical UFOs. Cylindrical, you say? Yes, that's his latest obsession. All he talks about is this cigar-shaped thing. But all these UFOs are saucers, right? It must have been something else, that's for sure. Boy, I hope he's not losing his mind. Your father has many faults, but he's pretty sharp. I've seen him shoot a gun more than a few times, you know. But I'll have a word with him, just in case, okay? Whatever you say. But don't encourage him and his crazy ideas, or you'll have me to deal with. are back, Daisuke! There was a huge one! I reckon it must be carrying the president of space! He'd better confess to his crimes! The president of space? Danbei, what are you talking about? A big cylindrical spaceship! It had a strange emblem on it, which I couldn't understand the meaning of. A kind of four-pointed star in a circle. It's the emblem of the Royal Guard. So King Vega mobilized it to kill me. And they'll kill thousands of men to get at me. I must warn Koji. I'm almost there, Daisuke. A few more menus, and I'll have cracked the secret of the Grand Diner Restaurant! For... Koji, I must get to the laboratory urgently. I'm counting on you to cover my back. Nobody must notice my absence. Okay, but why don't you ask me to go fight with you? Because these saucers are very special, Koji, and I must be the only one to deal with them. Daisuke, if anything happens to you, I won't forgive myself. Let me help you take them on. Koji, we can't take that risk. If anything happens to me, it will be up to you to defend this planet. I must go to the laboratory to confirm whether my fears are right. Don't attempt to follow me. Reassure me, Akira. Did the laboratory's instruments detect a huge cylindrical device in the last few days? A sort of capital ship? Not that I know of, Daisuke. Maybe this ship is camouflaged. We did pick up a few dots on the radar near the shoreline, but nothing out of the ordinary. On the other hand, I have indeed intercepted an abnormal number of Vega transmissions. Unfortunately, they're all encrypted, and even our supercomputer can't interpret them. What are these monsters talking about? A change of strategy, perhaps? Maybe. But whatever they're talking about, we can't let the Vega strike first. Not this time. I'll inform my father right away. I hear that things are getting interesting out by the shoreline. The Vega have something in mind, that's for sure.
Dad's not so interested in aliens. Shoot it. Geyser, go. Their base has opened. It's time to restore peace to this region for good. My name, Prince of the Stars. It is I, Lady Gandalf, who will send you to your doom. Prince Duke, you may have defeated our invading forces, but I will not let you sabotage our plans. This world will soon be ours, whether you like it or not. Tell me! Good luck, Daisuke.
shoot it. Dizer, go. Here you are, Daisuke. So, what are Vega's troops doing here? Cleaning up what they couldn't finish from the air, no doubt. All the more reason to patrol the area. Let's go! have made their base accessible, Daisuke. It's over to you. Pass here. We'll teach you some manners, Prince from the Stars! Lady Gandalf, the two of you aren't enough to stop me. I'll find all your buildings and bring them down one by one. I swear it.
Greetings, noble robot. Our co Shoot it. Geyser, go. Base is open to attack. Now you'll pay, you Vega scoundrels. You failed to protect our asset. I order you to make up for it immediately. See gravity stores! Gandalf's operation is losing ground. You think Grendizer can win? Grendizer, you help Earth.
shoot in. Geyser, go. Oh no, the whole capsule is under attack. Besides our friends, we have thousands of people to save. Let's go. out of the capital once and for all, Daisuke. Why do you persist, Prince Duke? The Earthlings built an entire city on top of this Vegatron. And they're not even using it. Show our guests who these resources will eventually belong to. Anti-gravity storm! Anti-gravity storm! Geyser punch!
Improving Grindizer. We're not the only city threatened. Shoot it! Dies a go! Koji, are you alright? Everything's fine, but the same can't be said of the airport. This airshow was supposed to reassure Earth. And Blackie turned it against us. Earth's not through yet, my friend. The Vega had a whole system deployed around this base. Their invasion is escalating. We had great ambitions for this place. If only you had interfered, Prince Duke. Sorry to disappoint you. Sorry to disappoint both of you, actually. But we have other plans for this region. You will pay for your insolence! Empty gravity score! to nothing, Daisuke. Excellent work. Let's keep our eyes open, Father. The reason the Vega are now setting up a full array is because they're getting a better fix on the Vegatron. This will make their attacks all the more devastating. Boomerang! Anti-gravity! 
Gravity Storm! Koji almost died. There you are, Mr. Robot, sir. 